we're here at the lower trommel rubber at the Worthington Diamond Recovery Plant. So the bulk of the material goes in here, rolls around in this scrubber trommel and breaks up some. Big rocks are discharged, but the majority of everything comes down this chute and rolls around in this scrubber and breaks up some more and even smaller. And the fine material you can see right here drops through into this chute and goes to the jig over on that side. That's where the diamonds are recovered. Now the fine material drops through there because this is a finer screen. Then we have a coarser screen here and the bigger rocks drop out and go down this chute, if you can see it, and it's did through a different set of two one square screens over on this side. That's where the jigging is going on. That's where the diamonds are found. Now, anything that's too big to drop through this coarse screen is going to run down here. And the plant, when it came from South Africa, this was the end of the story. All that would just drop on the ground and you'd have to scoop it up and get rid of it. But me, what I'm doing, I added this team engineering chute. It's really for gold recovery. And so the big rocks come down it, and the idea is that any diamond, if there was one that size, I don't want to miss it. No diamond left behind, big or small. And uh, it runs across a set of ripples. You can kind of see a ripple here. But uh, we have a, a ripple board, and I'll clean this out later tonight and make a video so you, so you can see the ripple board and see how it cleans out. But this, uh, the lighter big material goes into these buckets, and then we save these buckets of the oversized, and I'll bring you around here. Uh, I have Mac bring his kid steer around when he's done feeding the plant when those buckets fill up and we've been piling them here well that's that's uh, this year's oversized and what we need to do is leave it here to weather all winter so it'll freeze and break and any diamond that's in that will break down and be released from entombment in there well, that's what this pile is. This is last year's run. It looked like that. But this sat out here and weathered all winter. And now it, it would freeze and break it up and thaw. And now we have much smaller pieces. There's a lot of, anyway, it's broken down material. And before long, when we get done with other piles, we're gonna run this pile back through the plant and see if there were any diamonds we missed from last year in this this material so that's our plan and thank you for joining me here at the worthington diamond recovery plant in southwest arkansas